Uh, my first reaction uh, was uh, worried uh, for his well-being. I'm hoping that everybody, everything is going well. Worries for his family, uh, worries for his friends. Uh, this is a very emotional day for me personally as 18 years ago. I underwent my open heart situation and I don't wish that on anybody else. So hearing about someone close to me having played with LeBron um, and it's, it's very uh, a tricky situation. So all my thoughts and prayers and, and my heart literally goes out uh, to the friends, the family and everybody involved in this situation. What would, as somebody who has gone through, I mean, we don't know the details, but in terms of, you know, had a heart procedure done and something happened to Bronny, what would you say to, to the family? What would you say to LeBron? What would you say to Bronny? Because after your surgery, you did go on to have a successful NBA career. Most definitely. Uh, you know, the we have a brotherhood of uh, guys uh, that went uh, through open heart surgery. I know that I had someone like Fred Orberg that I could talk to uh, prior to my surgery and afterwards uh, we have various conversation uh, with the Zippo Club and the Zippo Club is the one that we went the, the heart surgery together so um, the, the, the thing that I could say and I don't wish him to go the, under any kind of uh, open heart surgery or whatever it may be but all I know is that every day he gets better uh, and I think that's really what it is uh, every day gets better and uh, pretty soon you will be looking at it as I started looking at it now uh, 18 years ago Bronny is is good friends with Sharif O'Neal, who also had a had some heart surgery several years back. Would you be open to talking to Bronny once he's you know okay and 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 ready to talk to people how to how to move forward? Uh, if Bronny ever wants to uh, to 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 talk, uh, I'm sure that uh, I'll be more than happy uh, to talk to him. But as you said, as you mentioned, he's a really good friend with Sharif, and uh, I had a chance to. Uh, to meet Sharif once or twice over over in my life. So I, I think when you have the proximity with someone like that, I think it's even better. But I feel like, once again, uh, we have the brotherhood, so we're always there for each other throughout the ups and also the downs. And I think that's what the basketball world is, is all about. We stick with each other, and I think that's a testament of the sports that we love, and it's about team sports, and it's about togetherness. So if at any given time... Um, He's winning. He wants to talk. I'm always available. After you went through, you launched the Heart to Heart Foundation. How important is it for, you know, people to be aware, people to get checked, all that your foundation does? How important is that to you and to everyone? Yeah, I mean, my foundation was only like a small snippet of what's really being done out there. Uh, and I feel like right now the foundation has been dormant because everybody else is doing so much great work out there. And I feel like we should all strive uh, to, 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 to raise awareness about the, the heart-related issues, um, being the number one killer in America. Um, and I think it's, it's important to get checked, but it's also important to uh besides the, the the checking aspect to tell people that we love them to appreciate what we have on a daily basis uh because tomorrow is not promised time is not promised and it's definitely important what the american heart association is doing there is so many programs out there and that, that, that are out there trying to do the good things so it's about just everybody just linking together and making sure that we all understanding the, the importance of, of, of those issues that are plaguing us. Ronnie, that, this was great. I really appreciate your time, especially on what's probably not the, the best day to look back at it. Thank you so much, okay? Thank you so much for having me, and I really and I really hope that everything is going to go well for, for Ronnie and his family. And I send them nothing but love. I really do.